What's cooking, Money and Life Movement? JJ Ramos is back. Welcome to my channel, and it's time again for Advocacy Friday. Well, <clears throat> I've come across this this blog post of mine again called "Negativity is a Demon," right? But unfortunately, I inadvertently <laughs> inadvertently deleted the video part from YouTube. All right, so. Well, if you still want to read the, con the continuation of that in the blog, well, of course, link in the description, right? <clears throat> basically says, I'm basically comparing uh, negativity to a, uh, to a demonic spirit, basically. I stated the four stages of demonic possession there. Now, if you would, if you're in the blog right now, I only stated part four there because the first three parts are in the video that was deleted. Okay, part four is possession. But bottom line, negativity is a demon. You're asking why? Well, if negativity possesses you, tuloy tuloy ang tuloy ang kanakakaini nito, right? You will have no sense of reason. You will have uh, no rational explanation for anything, right? Basically, well, kinain ka na ng ng negative, kinain ka na ng negative, ng negativity mo, ng negative mindset. That's just that's just the basic that's the basic premise. Okay. Now, there's an underlying cause. Okay. The biggest underlying cause of this is. Your own limiting beliefs. <laughs> yung mga beliefs na nakasanayan mo na since probably since birth <laughs> or since you since you started school, all right? Things like um, pati ka, pati mo, pati mo gayahin ang kapatid mo, pati mo gayahin tong kay tong tong best friend mo, honor student. Oh, naga ano, si pasipag mag-aral. Mga ganon or like um or the or the all time uh the all time worst or the all time worst advice, all right? You can ever get. Go to school, get good grades and have a safe secure job. Right? That can be a limiting belief. All right? That can be a limiting belief, mind you. All right? Any limiting belief leads nowhere but negativity. If you get sold on these limiting beliefs, I am very, very sure, kakainin ka nito. Kakainin ka niya na parang demonyo. You'll probably, you'll probably exhibit negativity so bad, someone might call in, someone might call in, might call in an exorcist to help you. Baka yung, mga, baka yung mga kaibigan o kamag-anak mo magtawag na ng pare para 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 limising ka. Kasi para sinanibang ka na nun. Right? That's, that's the analogy I made between negativity and demonic spirits. I hope you're in the blog post right now because, well, link is in the description below. And if you are, thank you for reading it. Kahit putol. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know why I uh, why I deleted that. I don't know. It's pro I probably deleted that way before I even conceptualized Advocacy Friday. All right, but that is the basic premise of the of the entire blog post. Okay. Again, I repeat. Negativity is a demon. If you allow it to run your life, God knows where you'll end up to. God knows where you will end up to. So don't let negativity ruin your life. Right? That's that's the best advice I can give you guys right now. Chill. Right? Pag may problem, pag may problema, smile muna. Chill muna. I assure you, you will think better that way. You will think of a better solution that way. Wag muna, wag nega agad. Wag nega agad. You have to think it over. 
take it over with a smile. Yeah. To be to be to be specific, right? I'm still here in uh, my favorite Japanese restaurant. I still haven't finished my lunch because of advocacy Friday. But hey, it's worth it, right? I can I can go back to it now. On to the objection of the week. Okay, I just received this from the courier. Yay, not out. From Little Warrior, ito. Ayan, it test natin ngayon. It test ko sa mismo unan ko. Mm. Bango. Bango. Okay, sir. Now that sponsors are done, it's time for the objection of the week. You may hear this when um when for a new uh, uh, from a new recruit or downline of yours. Nah, well. Let's see now. Uh, well, we single. Let's see. Mostly, most of the time, you would hear this objection from single people. Okay. Prospect palang or downline or recruit or even even kung assistant muna. If you're trying to scale your personal brand, all right. Siempre you have to go, you have to have an assistant. Okay. Here's the objection. It's night out. It's night out day for me. So ang gumimik na yun eh. Kaya may up and coming gimmick ako eh. Kaya hindi ko ma maasikaso yung offer mo eh. Or if they're your if they're currently your downline, uh, pass mo na yan. Pass mo na yan upline. I'm sure most veterans have heard, have heard this objection before. Now, let me let me clear the air on something. This is an objection slash excuse. Okay. If the prospect, okay, kung prospect palang siya, kung prospect palang siya, you now have a pretty good idea if you want, if you still want to. Uh, get him or her as a downline or recruit or whatever, whichever, or your assistant. Okay. Now, in that case, okay, let it slide. Pero, get instantly, instantly rebut with an appointment rescheduling. Okay. Don't go, don't go into justification mode yet, okay? Do not even tell that prospect to, well, baka pwede namang, wag ka muna gumimik ngayon, magkita tayo. No, don't do that, okay? You are trying to establish trust with that prospect, okay? Let it slide. Reschedule, reschedule an appointment, reschedule the appointment. Okay? Reschedule the meetup. Now, Kung downline mo na siya, or newbie sa sales team mo, or assistant mo, well, <laughs> you have to be, um, you have to show tough love. You have to show a little bit of tough love. If your downline gives you that excuse, here's what you can say. O oh, sige, have fun. In lang. Okay? Let's risk it. Let's uh, call me or no. Better yet, okay. Kung downline mo na siya, kung downline mo na siya or assistant or new rep. <clears throat> okay, have fun. Then, well, if you're done having fun, call me. Right. So you know, it's that simple. 
Okay? You have to be more tolerant than usual when it comes to objections as rare as this. Very rare objection yan. You have to be more tolerant. Okay? You have to be more professional. <clears throat> you have to be more professional. <clears throat> if it's still a prospect, whether, well, kung prospect man yan or downline mo na, don't go into justification mode. Right? <clears throat> kung downline mo yan, huwag mo ni susumbatan. <laughs> you will break that trust right there. I tell you. You will break that trust right there and then. Baka hindi na maging productive yan. Kung yari, kung downline mo na siya, baka hindi na maging productive yan. Alright? You are only their upline. Not their parents. Okay? Not even their, not even their spouse. Okay. Prospect yan, same thing. Say, bottom line, let it slide, reschedule. Okay? Let it slide, again, let it slide, and reschedule. If it's a down, if it's already, if he or she is already a downline of yours, tell them to have fun, and well, have them call you right after having fun. Okay. <clears throat> if you found val if you if you have found value in this episode, you know the drill. Hit that to subscribe, hit the bell, and comment with done. Now, if you're able to do that, I will feature your comment. I will feature your comment. Uh, in the, I will feature your comment before the end screen comes up. Alright? I'll even feature your channel in the end screen. If you do those three things, let me repeat. Hit that to subscribe. Hit the bell and comment with done. Now, you can, well, or you can add, you can add that, you can add to your, you can add to your comment, okay? Kasi, well, who knows? Baka ma-feature ko kayo sa next, uh, sa episode, sa ne siguro sa next available episode ng Advocacy Friday. I'll even feature your channel in the end screen. Na? Tamaan ko pa. <laughs> Tamaan ko pa yung aking lamp. That's the, that's the reward you're going to, that's the reward you're going to get. Alright? You do those three things. I'll feature your call. I will give you a shout out in the end screen, and I will feature your channel in the end screen. So that's a double three. Okay. Well, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. Hasta la vista, money and light movement.